Local 10 Sports with Will Manso. And we are live tonight in front of Jackson Memorial Hospital where a little over an hour ago Dolphins defensive tackle and former Kane Kendrick Norton was released here after two weeks in the hospital. It was a stay that was very difficult for Norton following that car accident that he had on July 4th. And during this day, he had multiple surgeries to get back to health. Remember, he lost his left arm because of that accident. So his football career is over. But the focus for him the last two weeks has been to get to this point, to recover well enough to be able to go home as he did today. And in a statement he said shortly after being released, he thanks so many different people, including the Dolphins and the Hurricanes. You know, the head coach has been here almost every day. You know, different people on the staff, players, um, all my former players from Miami, uh, coaches from Miami, even the head coaches, head strength, um, strength and conditioning coaches, the head coach, you know, everyone's been showing so much support and so much love, and uh, I really appreciate it. I just wanted to uh, thank everyone and let everyone know how much I really appreciate it. That was the statement made by Norton. He did not take any questions, but he certainly is lucky to be able to walk out today alive. Unfortunately, with the struggles now that his NFL career is over, but he is now focused on his future. That is the story from Jackson Memorial Hospital. I'm Will Manso, Local 10 News. The love and support from the Fins family and staff and from the U, of course, Will. Thank you so much.